Mm-hmm. We're live again. We're back. Is the picture moving now? <laughs> Don't censor me. This thing is angry, guys. Yeah. It's very difficult to keep this thing around and live. So here we are. Uh, we're going to talk about the ELR class training updates, which is on May 11th, I believe, when yes. is when it starts. For those of you that are in the central United States who are uh, RX alumni, who want to hang out with us uh, for a Magnum course where we're shooting pretty far, the ELR course is going to be held in West Texas at Hawks Double Mountain Ranch, which is kind of by Rotan, Texas. Uh, you can see rexdefense.com. Uh, for the uh, details of that class, you'll want to make your combinations just to remind you through HDMR, Hawks Double Mountain Ranch. Really nice folks. It'll be a cool environment because we're going to be able to actually all hang out kind of together at the place uh, that we're shooting. And so the literal place where we're actually staying, eating, shooting uh, is all at the same place. All the, all the different alumni will be there. Uh, the, the trainees and we're going to all hang out. We're going to go into the wee hours of the night discussing all the different uh, details that you're going to need to know throughout the, the course. Um, any issues that might happen in the field will be there um, as long as you need to be. So it's going to be relatively a different environment. It'll be cool because it'll be a smaller group of guys as well. Uh, a lot more detail oriented on some of those things. And so we just wanted to make sure everyone was caught up on the details there. It's going to be a Magnum rifle course. Uh, so you're going to need a big, heavy, hitting Magnum, um, something that can reach out. I would say you're going to have the most fun if you can get out to at least a mile, like 16, 1,700 yards, okay? Uh, 1,760 is a mile. Um, if you can get out to 2,000, we do have a big target up the, the back of a clip that's around 21, 2,200 yards, if I remember correctly. And uh, if you have something that's more ridiculous, you can't even go farther than that. Uh, so you can watch all the other, you can do a search in our uh, Taborosaurus Rex videos on YouTube, looking for the ELR subject matter, and uh, you will be able to find that. Also, we're gonna very soon send you out kind of a, another package of information um, that you're gonna need to have ready ahead of time and some of the other things. Uh, for, for you guys that are taking the ELR course, uh, you, you have already went through an RX live fire class, which means you've seen the process for gathering the information for your rifle. And so what's going to very much streamline this process is now that you're equipped to do so in terms of your, your skill set, if you have the equipment, and we'll bring equipment out to the event as well if you don't have it all squared away, um, you're going to want to gather your muzzle velocity information, very much similar to like we did at the live fire. Um, you're going to want to do it exactly like we showed you how to do it there, uh, establish a, a, a steady rhythm of uh, uh, fire in terms of your pace. Don't let the round cook for more than a second. Uh, get your muzzle velocity, at least five shots, and then uh, gather all the other inputs that you're going to need. And then we're going to be putting that together when we get out there on the range, and it'll be, um, it'll be a good time. We're going to show you different ways to balance ballistic information. Uh, you're going to also want to bring your favorite ballistic computer if you have one. When you're talking about extreme long ranges, you're going to need something very, very precise and having something that can also balance out all those different inputs on a computer scale is going to be handy, although we will show you how to also integrate that into a written system as well because uh, a lot of the, the one of my friends, Eduardo, he was actually a guy who's uh, won a lot of the one mile competitions, world records, things like that, the 50 calibers. Um, he's uh, the king of the two mile guy. I mean, he's kind of the master on that. And he he does use charts, but he uses it with his ballistic software. And I think he's actually running uh, a Garmin, I think at the moment. And whatever ballistic software you're using, you're gonna wanna organize that every morning before you got on your operation. And uh, we'll show you how to do that properly. So whatever ballistic software you're running, uh, if whether that be a Kestrel or, or a program on your phone or JBM. Uh, if you've got something on your computer that you've been using forever, uh, you can bring that to the ELR course. We're going to use that to generate your ballistic data. We're going to do it enough times to where you actually become viable doing that in the field. And uh, you will know how to do it by the time you leave this course. Because when you're talking about the distances involved with ELR shooting, uh, you're going to have to actually be very intimate with that subject and know how all the different things balance out in the real world and how to troubleshoot that. So that's one of the things we're gonna be doing at the course. Uh, so we just wanna let you guys know to be prepared for that deal as well. We do have that recommended in our equipments list from a while back. Bring whatever uh, ballistic support software you have. If you have anemometers, 
if you have your barometers, stuff like that, is all stuff you have to start really being worried about once you start getting into extreme long range precision shooting. Uh, it's a whole nother world out there beyond a thousand meters. Those things, the small atmospheric differences make a pretty big difference at those distances. And so it's gonna be fun guys. We just wanna let you know that uh, we're getting ready to roll for that. We will be down. That's gonna be one week after the event in Rotan, Texas which is the, uh, or excuse me, one one week after the Denton, Texas event. Denton, Texas. Yeah, which is our RX-18 seminar. And uh, so for those of you guys that are uh, excited about that, who haven't seen the seminar yet, if you're in Texas, man, and you haven't been to a seminar and you want to see one of them, this might be your last chance for either a long time or indefinitely. We don't have no idea what the future of the training events is going to be. We're just kind of playing it by ear right now. It's a lot of fun to do it. And so we're going to be there uh, one month from now in uh, Denton, Texas, which is in the Dallas area. If you can make it, that'd be awesome. Like we said before, we're going to make a donation of the proceeds to the Wheelchairs for Warriors guys. And yeah. so it'll be a nice way to support them guys as well. And we hope to see you. Awesome. Can I go ahead? Um, so, and I'm, I'm sorry about my cracked screen, but I just want to show you guys how to get into the, the buttons with the ELR because I had a couple questions on the email. When you get to this screen, this is on rexdefense.com and it's on my cracked phone, but when you get to rexdefense.com, you get to the screen, it lists all the events by type. I'm gonna go into the ELR class. So the ELR class is right here. Click purchase ticket to see more information. So I click purchase ticket and then it's gonna bring up another screen. Dun, dun, dun. Maybe. Maybe my phone's <laughs> really slow today, guys. Give it one second. So bad. We got we're out in the middle of nowhere, guys. We're in yes. the sticks. So okay, brings up the next screen. ELR HMR. It gives you way more information on the event. And you can say read more on there if yes. you want the full details. It'll tell you where yeah. it's at, all that stuff. Weapons for those selection. of you. Yeah, what what your equipment list is going to be listed on here if you scroll down. It'll have a very detailed list of the equipment we recommend you to bring to the class. And uh, so ELR is very equipment dependent, like we've said before. And so you're going to have, want to have the right gear for that. Or it's not going to be as fun. Although when I was out there with uh, Joe Nixon and his boys, they were shooting an AR-15 with a Seymour optic at like a 1,000 yards. Just laughing. Well, that's good. <laughs> and they were hitting the steel, man, after a little while. But it was a lot of fun. So we're going to have good times up there. Everyone's pretty laid back. I look forward to seeing you guys at the ELR class. And so if you guys have any questions, we're going to not make this video nine hours long. We'll stop this one here. Let this be a concise video by itself. And then we'll come back and continue the show with something on the entertaining end, possibly. possibly. Questions and answers will be coming up next. But if you have any training questions, you can put them down here in the uh, comments section. and uh, Or you can go to rexdefense.com to get an update on the training. Absolutely. And if you want to contact us with any questions about training that you want to talk to us personally about, go to rexdefense.com, click contact, and any of those emails will get you an answer. Rock and roll, guys. Thanks a bunch for viewing the video, and we'll catch you around.